To find the maximum or minimum value of a quadratic function, start with the general form of the function and combine any similar terms. For example, if you're starting with the function f x equals 3x plus 2x minus x squared plus 3x squared plus 4, you would combine the x squared and the x terms to simplify and end up with fx equals 2x squared plus 5x plus 4. Now, figure out which direction the parabola opens by checking if a, or the coefficient of x squared, is positive or negative. If it's positive, the parabola opens upward. If it's negative, the parabola opens downward. In the function fx equals 2x squared plus 5x plus 4, the coefficient of x squared is positive, so the parabola opens upward. Next, find the x value of the vertex by solving negative b2a, where b is the coefficient in front of x and a is the coefficient in front of x squared. In the function fx equals 2x squared plus 5x plus 4, b equals 5 and a equals 2. Therefore, you would divide negative 5 by 2 times 2, or 4, and get negative 1.25. Finally, plug the x value into the function to find the value of fx which is the minimum or maximum value of the function. The function fx equals 2x squared plus 5x plus 4 would become f negative 1.25 equals 2 negative 1.25 squared plus 5 negative 1.25 plus 4 or f negative 1.25 equals 0 0.875. If the parabola opens upward, your answer will be the minimum value. If the parabola opens downward, your answer is the maximum value. In this example, since the parabola opens upward, f negative 1.25 equals 0 0.875 is the minimum value of the function.